Hey, Happy New Year, everybody. It's Art by Rachel Ray. Welcome back to my channel. All right, so it's 2016, guys, and we are having New Year's resolutions, right? So one of my biggest New Year's resolution is to continually and always be saving money, being smart with my money, and saving and, you know, paying down debt and everything. And so one of the big ways that I do that is I coupon and I'm using deals. I use a lot of um, deal apps to make sure I'm getting back some money, getting extra money, saving on things. And so I wanted to do a video for you guys. So there are like a lot of coupon apps. I mean, it'll be impossible for me to go over every single one of them with you guys. But I'm gonna go over the ones that I personally use, the ones that I've gotten money back from. So if you want to learn about all the coupon apps that I use, keep watching. Make sure to click like, make sure to comment, make sure to subscribe and share this video so everyone can start saving some money, okay? All right, so first I'm gonna start off with grocery. So apart from couponing, I definitely use some apps to make sure that I'm getting some money back when I go grocery shopping. So the first app that I use is a Walmart Savings Catcher app. If you have a Walmart near you, this is the app you need to be using. So basically you just go shopping at Walmart and then when you're finished, you get your receipt and you go to the Savings Catcher app here. You go to scan receipt on your phone and then you literally just take a picture of your receipt and Walmart scans like all the different groceries, um, other all the other different grocery stores around the area. And if one of the items on your receipt are cheaper at another store, Walmart will refund you money back into an e-gift receipt. So it scans for every item in your receipt and you can do it multiple times a day, just every single receipt. Just make sure you're always scanning it if you're shopping at Walmart. Now the only catch is when you get back the money, you have to use it at Walmart, but still, I mean, Walmart has everything, right? All right. All right, so the next app that I have is called Ibotta, and I know a lot of people have heard about this app, but if you haven't, this is one of my favorite apps. This app, after you go grocery shopping, you can go to a bunch of stores that it has on here, Walmart, Target, Walgreens, CVS, and um, has certain items, and they change about every week, uh, that you can get cash back rebates on. And so I shop at Walmart a lot, and so I'll just go to the Walmart and it has different items that you can get cash back on. For example, Jif peanut butter it has on right now, Hot Pockets, eggs, you know, things that you actually buy. And so after you buy it, you go on the app and you click to redeem and you get maybe like 50 cents to $2, sometimes $4 on more expensive items. And then you get cash back. When you reach about $10, you can either put it on a gift card or you can put it to your PayPal account, which is what I do, and you get cash right there. Another app that is the same exact thing is uh, Checkout 51, and it's the same exact concept as Ibotta, um, but they have different items on Checkout 51, so sometimes I go to Ibotta, Checkout 51. Another one is called Shop Meum. All right, so let's start going to more um, couponing apps and there are just so many couponers and people you can follow and apps that just show you like a wide range of which, what's going on, what's on sale. My personal favorite is Retail Me Not. Now this is my go-to app. This is an app you need to download on your phone, okay guys? So this app works basically, it scans every single store and it tells you every single coupon, coupon codes, deals, every single store that you shop on online and in store. So basically, whenever you go into a store, you want to check Retail Me Not. You want to be like, hold on. So you want to go to your Retail Me Not every time you go into a store. And you want to check if you get, if there's like any coupons out for that store. You want to check if there's any coupon codes, if you're shopping online. And it has literally every store. And before you buy anything, you want to make sure that you can't get a percentage off or any coupons on the site or in the store. It has literally every store and I'm literally on this app almost every single day if I'm shopping, okay? Another app that I use is the Target Cartwell app and these are more store specific, okay? This is the Target Cartwell app and if you shop at Target a lot and I'm actually starting to become more of an avid Target shopper, they have different items with um, certain percentage off and then you add it to your little cart and when you get the item in the store, you actually scan the app. They can scan the app at the register 
This also is in use with coupons. If you have a coupon for the item, if you have a coupon for an item and then you have a car rob, you can stack the coupons and you can save a lot of money, guys. All right, so now I'm gonna go to more um, online coupon apps that I use. So the first one is a really big one and it is called Ebates. Ebates is a cashback app if you shop online. So some people like to shop on store. I personally am an online shopper. I like to shop online all the time. So Ebates is in partnership with a bunch of online retailers. And what you do is you go to Ebates first. So say you want to shop at, let's say, Target.com, for example. You go to Ebates first, and then you go and you find Target. And then you want to do the search engine, and you want to go and find Target or whatever store that you're looking for. And for example, Target's having 2% cash back right now. So you just click the shop now and it actually takes you to the Target website or whichever website that you're shopping on. And then you just continue to shop like normal. And then it will give you cash back into a bank in here. And you know, when you go to your bank, it tells you when they're having the big fat payment next and then it will transfer. You can either ask to get a check, I believe, or it transfers into your PayPal account. And like I said, I always just transfer money into my PayPal account. All right, so the next apps I use are apps that when you walk into a store that you receive points or when you do service you get points and then your points add up and you can cash them in to get gift cards so the ones that I use the first one is called swag bucks Ooh. swag bucks and swag bucks is an app that where you do simple things if you're just bored at home you can go on swag bucks they have different surveys different videos that you can watch and then you get points for it or swag bucks and then the swag bucks add up and you can cash them in for gift cards Another app that's kind of the same is called Survey Mini. And basically you put on your location on the phone and anytime you go somewhere, like to the store, to the grocery store, somewhere out to eat, it will send you a survey about the service that you received there. And then you get points for doing the survey. And again, you can cash them in to get gift cards. And these are gift cards to like restaurants, stores, Amazon, like these are really big gift cards. Same one, and another one that I use is Shopkick, and this is uh, based on your location as well. Whenever you walk into a store, you put on your location and you check in that you're at that store and it gives you points. And then it gives you different items that it wants you to scan in the store. So if you have some time on your hand, you can walk around the store and scan these different items and it gives you points as well, which you can cash in for gift cards. So the apps that I use to get like just more affordable or discounted stuff. And well, the first one is called Groupon. And another one that I use is called Me Social. They give you discounts on different things to do in the area. You put in your location, it tells you what's going on in the area and discounts on food, concerts and items, traveling, hotels, like these apps are huge. For example, for a massage, you can pay $30 and it's usually $90. You pay for 30 and then you just book your appointment. So I use Groupon Living Social all the time sometimes. So speaking of traveling, because you can get hotels and getaways on Groupon Living Social, here are my favorite travel apps. Um, for traveling in general, I love Travel Zoo. Travel Zoo is a, compil a compilation. Is that what I said? A compilation? It compiles all of the best travel and discounts around the whole internet and it puts them all in one app for you. Travel Zoo, like I said, compiles um, discounts for flights, hotel, getaways. I mean, like six long getaways to like China and it tells you which website is giving you for the cheapest at the time. So if you like to travel, which I love traveling, I like to go to Travel Zoo. It shows you what cruises are having the biggest discounts, what airlines are having the biggest discounts and it compiles them, like I said, all of them on this easy to use app. Another one that I use if you have flexible dates is called Hotel Tonight. And this is basically if you want a hotel that night, like tonight you want a hotel, it will scan the area and tell you really cheap hotels. Like I have gotten hotels for maybe $200 normally and I got it for like 50 bucks. So like I said, it's for tonight, but actually I've recently went on the app and it actually, you can book up to seven nights in advance with that same deep discounted rate. So if you're traveling in the same week or so, then you can actually book on a hotel tonight for a really heavily discounted price. 
last but not least, what you guys need to do if you want to get some really good coupons for different restaurants and different stores and retails is you want to always subscribe to their newsletter, okay? Yes, you will get hundreds of emails a day. I do, I do, but those are coupons in those emails those are coupon codes in those emails so if you like different restaurants oh you always sign up for their newsletter most restaurants offer like a free meal on your birthday so you definitely want to get it on that I all right guys so thank you so much for watching my video i hope my tips and advice are going to help you start getting on your saving for 2016 and help you find some really good deals and save some money so i hope this video helped you please make sure to like comment and subscribe for more videos and if you guys have any more coupon apps that you didn't see in my video, please link them down below so I can start using them too. I will link every app that I said and I'll link it below so that you guys can sign up for it and start saving some money for 2016. All right, so thanks so much for watching. Love you guys and I hope you have a great happy new year. Mwah.